With a brand new building and a brand new name, Dixie Technical College made history with firsts during its graduation ceremony. Congratulations, graduates. You are the first graduating class of Dixie Tech here in our new permanent campus. This is, this is exciting. First graduating class from Dixie Tech, first graduating class in this new facility. Um, this is the first time that we've been able to have graduation at our own place. Usually we rent space from DSU, but uh, this is exciting and there's a real energy here that we have not felt before. Rushton said it's also the largest number of students graduating from Dixie Tech this spring, with 400 students earning their certificates. Dixie Tech is seeing growth campus-wide, but there are those trades that are excelling above others. There's been incredible growth throughout all of the industries, especially in our medical industries and the IT industries. Um, but even our industrial programs are, are taking off. We just opened um, our auto tech program as well as a collision repair program. Keynote speaker and board member Darcy Stewart gave the graduates tips for their future employment. As the CEO of Sun River, he emphasized how employers want results. He encouraged graduates to think positive thoughts. Train your brain how to produce results. If you put that in, your subconscious mind will work even while you're sleeping and will help you come up with and overcome challenges. Many of the students graduated with honors, like student speaker Derek Vowles, a drafting program graduate. I learned a valuable trade that will keep me employed for years to come. I've gotten myself out of debt. I found the girl of my dreams and somehow convinced her to marry me. I've been able to spend more time with family and loved ones and I've finally gained a new sense of confidence in myself and in knowing that I take pride in my work and love what I do. Never become stagnant. Stay hungry. Always stay learning and never, ever, ever give up. While the graduates' names were called forward one by one, there were many others who weren't able to attend as they already had jobs and were making money. Ryan Gould's parents came all the way from Oregon to see their son graduate. He um, started with the company about two and a half years ago and um, they told him that if he wanted to stay with the company then he had to go to school and that they would pay for half of it. So he is now graduating, which we are so proud of him and couldn't be more excited and we're excited. Pretty exciting. I never thought I'd be, you know, a graduate of anything, so. As far as the time they've spent learning these trades, it varies from program to program. Some students have been able to complete their certificates in as little as two months. Others have spent two years. And non-traditional students are typical at technical colleges. This father, son, and daughter trio all graduated from Dixie Tech together. It took them two years to complete their certificate in manufacturing operations. Yeah, all three of us actually work at the Walmart Distribution Center. Come August, I'm going to be uh, putting my resume out there hot and heavy and uh, work my way into a management position and move forward with my career. I'm going to continue on with my education, hopefully get some master's degrees, finish out school, and then get into an administrative position in the medical field at some point. That would be really exciting. Despite some uh, embarrassing moments, like I said, I'm definitely proud that I and happy that I did it with my dad and my sister. It's definitely made it uh, a lot better, a lot more of an, a learning experience. For many of these students, they are the first in their families to graduate from a higher education program. And about a dozen of these students are still in high school. With the pomp and circumstance over and a turn of their tassels, the two graduating classes will head out into the world with skills and knowledge needed to succeed in their career fields. So as you go out there in the world, and as you take on these careers that you've trained yourself to do, remember every day when you wake up, enjoy the journey. Family members and friends are just as excited for their new chapters to begin. From Dixie Tech, Melissa Anderson, CEC News.